Hello everyone, welcome back here out of office. Do you know about temporary residence? Do you know what is needed in order to obtain it? If no, then stay tuned, grab some paper and pen and let's get into it. The temporary residence is a document that only EU and EFTA citizens plus their family members are entitled to request. The document looks something like this and can and should be requested at the Foreign Police Office at Hnievkovskeho 65. For the temporary residence, you will need following documents. Passport or ID card, one photo of yourself, and you would also need confirmation of your employment or confirmation of your studies from the university. Next, you would need medical insurance valid in Czech Republic. You'd also need accommodation contract or confirmation of your accommodation. The address and the name of the property owner has to match with what is written in the stand land registry. This document should be older than six months. Have in mind that the confirmation of accommodation, unlike the original contract, has to have the owner's signature notarized. The resident certificate for EU citizens usually takes up to two months to be processed. And it also comes with Rodnai číslo, sort of a birth number. But don't get alarmed if you first receive only the confirmation of your residence permit, because sometimes it takes a little longer for the birth number to arrive. If that's the case, then you simply have to go to the office one more time and pick up the Rodnai číslo birth number separately. For more information, visit the official ministry portal. The link will be in the description box beneath this video. There is also a way for non-EU citizen to get the temporary residence. However, the main condition is that this person has to be a family member of another EU or EFTA citizen that lives in Czech Republic. The EU family member is required to submit following documentation that has to be either original or has to be notarized and should have official Czech translation attached to it. So you will need a passport, two photographs of yourself, a document confirming the relationship with EU or EFTA citizen. Next, what is needed is birth certificate, marriage certificate or medical report. Also, a proof of medical insurance here in Czech Republic is needed. And last but not least, accommodation contract or a confirmation of accommodation with both names, the EU or EFTA citizen and the applicant's name in it. The immigration office can either invite the applicant and the EU or EFTA family member to an interview, or they can also send an immigration officer to their residence address and to verify whether they really share the household or not. One of the advantages when applying for the temporary visa as a family member of EU or EFTA citizen is that this person automatically receives a visa for stay in the Czech Republic that covers the period from arriving to the country until the paper is issued, meaning approved or declined. However, have in mind that if you do apply for temporary residence as non-EU citizen, you're not allowed to leave the country during this issuing period unless you have confirmation that you can come back to Czech Republic. So better to stay in the Czech Republic until the papers are finally issued. And again, for more information, make sure to visit the official ministry portal that will be linked in the description box below this video. And of course, we promised you that we will teach you a little bit of Czech. And so the sentence, obviously, for this video is I need a temporary residence. And in Czech it would be Potřebuji přechodný pobyt. Make sure to check the description box below this video because we will link all the necessary information to this topic. We also made a video about how to obtain your accommodation confirmation, so make sure to check it out and stay tuned because we will also be doing a video about the permanent residence. If you like this video, give us a like. Don't forget to comment below and let us know what is your experience with obtaining following documents. And of course, click here to subscribe to our channel and click here to watch our last video because we make videos about Brno every single week. See you next time, out of office.